Good evening, good evening, good evening. This is the Minister M.L. Kimball coming to you live, and we have to talk about something that my brother-in-law just sent to me that I we have to talk about this. We have to cover this. Have you ever heard of the North American Man Boy Love Association? Have you ever heard of that? Well, guess what? We're going to go ahead and uh, review this real quick because you guys are not going to believe what I just didn't even realize that um, was was actually okay. And uh, this is what makes this complete liberal left side, whatever you want to call it, uh, an absolute disaster and, and completely corrupt. Because why isn't anybody saying stuff about this? This is what makes this stuff completely a disaster. So I'm going to share my screen and we're going to talk about this uh, this complete disgrace called the North American uh, Boy Love Association. Now, this is obviously Wikipedia, but they do have a website so you can go to the website and see exactly uh, what they stand for. But I'm going to read just a little of this to you and uh, we're, we're going to have to take a look at this because this is absolutely ridiculous. I didn't even know this existed. The North American Man Boy Love Association, N-A-M-B-L-A, -A, stylized as N-A-M-B-L-A, -A, is a pedophilia and pedestrian advocacy organization in the United States. It works to abolish age of consent laws, criminalizing adult sexual involvement with minors, and campaigns for the release of men who have been jailed for sexual contacts with minors that did not involve what is considers, considers coercion. The group no longer holds regular national meetings and as of the late 1990s to avoid local police infiltration, the organization discouraged the formation of local chapters. Around 1995, an undercover detective discovered that there were 1,100 people on the organization's rolls, 1,100 people. NAMBLA was the largest group in the International Pedophile and Child Emancipation, IPCE, an international pro-pedophile activist organization. Since then, the organization has dwindled to only a handful of people, with many members joining online pedophile networks. According to Xavier von Eric, Director of Operations at the Anti-Pedophile Organization Perverted Justice, as of 2005, a newspaper report stated that NAMBLA was based in New York and San Francisco. So I want you to understand that we are living in the last days. When things like this become normal, you have to really, really be worried about what, 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 what position that this nation is headed into. When you can tell someone that they can naturally be attracted to a child and it's okay, that is a problem. And we have to stand up against this stuff. And what bothers me the most is the fact that you so-called Christianized churches who are supposed to stand for truth and stand for what the Bible calls truth, you get behind and support this for identity politics because you're black, we should vote for Kamala. No, they are okaying whatever definition of gender that a person comes up with. That means that I've been 40 years as a man, born as a man, but yet I decide today or tomorrow I wanna become a woman. I don't go get any surgeries or anything. I walk around as a man and then because I feel like I wanna be a woman, I'm legally able to walk into the bathroom with your daughters and your granddaughters. And you're going to tell me that that's okay? I'm supposed to support that? No way. I can't get behind it. And you, as an African-American citizen, you better take a look at what this agenda is doing to your children, our family, and the community as a, as a whole. How can you get behind something that is so demonic and support it and never be called out on it? We need to stand up and protect our children. It's a lot of sick people walking around thinking that it's okay to take away a child's innocence. And that's a problem. That's a problem. I can't support anybody that comes up with the excuse of why they feel like they should be attracted to a child. I'm the Minister ML Kimball. Until next time, be blessed.
on purpose. Mm -hmm.